Once firefighters leave this building, they often see some pretty awful things. People's livelihoods going up in flames or injured loved ones. And it's things they can't easily forget. But that's why each station is working on a way to bring about some new happy memories. Just to kind of keep everything in check and make sure everything's getting maintained well. And a firefighter's work isn't over once a call ends. But this week, there's some added tasks. <laughs> How does wrapping presents compare? Uh... It's it's not bad. It's 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 never been my strong suit. That's for sure. Firefighters don't train for this, and even the ones who have the skill set try and keep it hidden. Don't tell my wife I know how to wrap. <laughs> but they're doing it this week, and with a smile. And the guys enjoy this too. I mean. <laughs> That's because these gifts are going to some very deserving families. You know, this doesn't solve all their problems, but, you know, if we can help them out just around the holidays, then, you know, it's, I guess it's one positive thing that we can do for them. Two of the families Station One is providing gifts for lost a loved one this past year. It's that kind of heartbreak that these firefighters see day in and day out. As you get to know uh, what's going on, you know, they really, they really tug at your heart, so that's why we ended up with three families this year instead of just our usual one. Three families will be receiving everything from home goods to winter gear and, of course, gifts for the kids. Mm, we've got some Star Wars socks as well. I just learned a bit about hex bugs. Uh, I've got some zoo passes, some get air passes. While it might not be their typical work or even something they know much about, they don't mind the challenge of, you know, wrapping a stuffed koala bear. No, this is first here at the station for me. But I can't complain. Oh, that's me. This holiday, the firefighters of AFD are helping people in the community, even between calls. Each station plans to deliver their presents on Christmas Eve, but they say if you've got anything you'd still like to donate, they are more than happy to take it. Just make sure that it's not wrapped. Reporting from Station 1, Mallory Peebles, Channel 2 News.